Stop touching me. Now is not the time to be selfish. Now is the time to commit to a community, to be part of something. Our vision for the future is rooted in hope. It ensures a future for humanity. <laughs> there is no point in clinging to it. Do not commit to isolation. Dedicate yourself to a grander purpose, and you will not be alone. Trust in us to guide you, and we will put our trust in you. Within our walls, you will be safe. Within our walls, your needs no one will gets inside. Be Strict orders. Within a our walls, with that. See Jeff. He's around life the goes on. The tower will always stand. I should have known better, Mama. What was he? You got nerve rolling in here uninvited. Don't mean to intrude. We don't need strays poking around right now. We have enough problems to deal with. Maybe I'm the solution. You know what? Yeah, you might prove useful. My brother is in some deep shit. Pack of reclaimed scum snatched him. Anthony's a good kid. Bit dim. But he doesn't deserve whatever those freaks have in store. We can't get anywhere near where they're holed up. Light Blue House across the way. They'll gut him immediately if they see us coming. But you? They don't know you. You'll be able to stroll right in. After that, whatever you need to do, that's your business. Sounds like I can be of service. Get to it then. Knowing how those savages operate, you might not have the time before they execute him. Anthony, how could he be so dense? He should have known better. What was he thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
hell are you? The negotiator? A big tough Jeff, too chicken shit to show his face and beg for his little brother's life? Not sure I really see the point. I guess I'm here to negotiate a deal for Anthony's release. Release? That's some kind of joke? That motherfucker isn't going anywhere but in the dirt, where maggots belong. What did he do? This subhuman shit is a murderer. My daughter is dead. The tower is at fault, and he is at fault. The tower preaches community, and yet they toss out those most in need because they are no longer useful, because they are a burden. Violet was not a burden. She was a human being, but this fucker treated her like trash. He could have disobeyed orders, but he did not. He forced her out, left her to die. She was 11 years old. Where is your head at, stranger? Exterminate this tower fuck right now, and we won't have a problem. Then we can pay the rest of the vermin a visit. And once they are a pile of corpses, whatever is in their camp, it's yours. Consider it a gift from the reclaimed. He deserves to die, and I will gladly do it. I followed orders. That's all I'm guilty of, please. It wasn't my decision. The hesitation. We did what we had to do, right? What's your take on all this? If the fighting keeps up, this city's gonna explode into an all-out war. The tower maintains some sort of order, right? I mean, they, they offer some sort of semblance of safety, sure, but they don't hesitate to toss people out if they question authority. Once the tower kicks your ass out, there's no return. It seems cruel, but I don't know. Maybe that's the way it has to be. The reclaimed are eccentric. Let's put it that way. But JB really knows how to motivate, get people to buy into his vision. Maybe they're crazy, maybe they're onto something. I don't know, who knows? They are inspired, though. We're always going on about the liberation to live, not just blindly following orders to barely survive. I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe they're both a bit fucked in the head. I know Omri is dead, and I know that for the time being you stepped into his shoes, whoever you are. I am not in the habit of trusting people these days. Don't get used to meeting like this. It's a rarity. I understand. It's almost impossible to know who to trust. All right, then we're on the same page. I'll get to the point. Why are you helping me? Henri trusted you. So that's good enough for me. Were you two friends? I guess you could say we were new friends, sure. I saved his ass from a slew of walkers in the bayou, and I liked talking to the guy. He had a way about him. He sure did. My daughter was fond of him. Loved the way he could spin a tale. 
Well, may he rest in peace. You got some curmudgeonly shoes to fill. I'll point you to tower caches with useful supplies, and you get me the intel they contain. Sound like a deal? Maybe. But I have a question first. The tower seems to be after you and your daughter hardcore. What's that all about? You spotted those posters, huh? You wanna go there? All right, I'll give you the basics. I used to be with the tower. Now I'm not. We don't see eye to eye. I'm in the right, they are in the wrong. That's all I got for you now. This time, yeah. Can't make any promises long term, though. Fair enough. No promises from me either. Take this drawing. There's some intel at the location in the drawing. When you have it, leave it for me at the usual spot. What's with the drawing? My daughter Ambra has a gifted eye and a gifted hand. It's her way of staying sane. She's watching right now. Probably documenting this exact moment. Or maybe she's just sketching a dead cat. I'll never know. Oh, my God. 